text message scandal that rocked the Antioch Police Department was front and center in a Contra Costa County courtroom this morning, where a group of officers is expected to testify before a judge. Da Lin was in the courtroom today and has more on why we still haven't heard from those officers and why the outgoing chief of police won't have to testify after all. A packed courtroom. Many people were turned away because there weren't enough seats. No cameras allowed. Everyone wanted to hear from the officers who are accused of being racist. No justice, no peace. You racist, police. While it was loud outside the courthouse, the only sound inside came from a judge and attorneys. A few attorneys spent much of the day fighting for their clients, Antioch police officers, why they should not have to testify in the hearing. Out of the nine Antioch officers subpoenaed, the judge only granted the request by Antioch Police Chief Steve Ford to not have to testify. The judge says that's because Chief Ford took over the department one year after the tech scandal had happened. Chief Ford also announced his resignation this week. I want justice to be served. And what, what's justice to you? Them to go to jail, they pensions took, and them to go to jail. Justice. Sherelle Copps is one of the people who packed the courtroom. Her son, Trent Allen, was the subject in some of the alleged police text messages. Investigators say officers joked about kicking her son's head. Investigators say some officers also used the N-word and compared black people to gorillas and monkeys. He said he kicked his head like a field goal. And he meant that because I looked it up. He was a, he was a professional soccer player in college. He meant that. He said his foot hurt it. That's how hard that he kicked my son in his head. Her son and three others are facing murder and attempted murder charges in a drive-by shooting case from 2021. Legal experts say if the officers involved in the case are found to be racist and acted with racial bias in the case, the murder charges will likely be dropped. They already targeted him, so I don't know what, what they could have did. They already falsified police reports and everything else. Yes, his case should be dismissed because these officers was on his case. We only heard from an expert witness late in the afternoon. The judge says the hearing will continue next month on August 25th. That's when we expect to hear from officers involved in the text message scandal. Again, the Antioch police chief will no longer have to testify.